hello friends in the current video tutorial I am going to talk about this array interpolate array function available in the array uh, palette in LabVIEW so this is interpolate 1d array function and uh, let's see how to use this function so in this program I have made a for loop so it is generating elements from 1 to 10 and here I am choosing a fractional index and this is interpolate 1d array function and this is the interpolated value so let's run this program and see what are the results and try to interpret the results so if I put the fractional index as 3.5 so let's see how the result is coming when I run this function the output is 4.5 so how does this output 4.5 is coming since the fractional index is 3.5 so we have to consider the element at index 3 so element at index 3 is this element 4 because the indexing in LabVIEW starts from 0 so this is the element which we have to consider and then the fractional index is 0 0.5 so the difference between 4 and the next element 5 is 1 and 0 0.5 of 1 is 0 0.5 so the interpolated value is 4.5 now suppose I change this value to say 6.3 so I have to consider the element at place 6 index 6 so index 6 element is 7 and then I have to consider the fractional index of 0 0.3 the next element is 8 8 minus 7 is 1 fractional 0 0.3 fractional index of 1 is 0 0.3 so value coming would be 7.3 so see the value is 7.3 let's see some more um, examples of this fractional index so here I have taken these values in an array so I am taking the fractional index as 1.5 so I have to consider the uh, element placed at index 1 so the element placed at index 1 is 5.2 so uh, the next element is 7.8 so uh, the fractional index is 0 0.5 right so I have to uh, calculate as follows as the fractional index is 1.5 so we have to see the elements at index 1 which is 5.2 and the next element is um, 7.8 minus uh, uh, 7 point, uh, next element is 7.8 and we have to subtract uh, uh, 5.2 from 7.8 which results in the value of 2.6 so 0 0.5 multiplied by 2.6 gives 1.3 so the interpolated value should be 5.2 plus 1.3 is equal to 6.5 so let's run this program and see so the value is 6.5 let's see one more example so here the fractional index is 1.69231 and here are the elements and I am doing the calculation as follows so since the fraction index is 1.69231 so I have to consider the value at index 1 so that value is 5.2 now 7.8 the next value minus the previous value uh, uh, the one less value uh, the value at one less index is 5.2 so 7.8 minus 5.2 is 2.6 and 2.6 multiplied by the fractional index will generate approximately 1.8 uh, 0, 0, 0, 0, so the interpolated value is 5.2 plus 1.8 0, 0, 0, 0, and the result is 7.00006 right let's run this program so see the result is approximately same because uh, 6 is rounded off to 1 so here we have how many zeros 1 2 
थ्री फोर एंड फाइव जीरोस एंड देन सिक्स एंड ओवर हेयर इन द लैब व्यू कैलकुलेटेड आंसर वी हैव वन टू थ्री फोर जीरोस एंड इफ वी हैव द नंबर लाइक ओवर हेयर सो सिक्स इज राउंडेड ऑफ एंड द नंबर इज सेवन पॉइंट जीरो 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 एंड वन सो द आंसर इज करेक्ट लेट्स डू वन मोर क्वेश्चन so in this i have taken the fractional index as 7.5 so fractional index 7.5 means that i have to see the element placed at index 7 so that is actually the eighth element so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 so the element is 12.9 we have to see and uh, the next element is 15.5 so we subtract the value of 15.5 uh Uh, subtract the value of 12.9 from 15.5 and the result is 2.6 and since the fractional index is 0.5 so 0.5 multiplied by 2.6 gives 1.3 so the interpolated value should be 12.9 plus 1.3 that will give it as 14.2 so let's run this program so the value is 14.2 so this is how interpolate 1d array works i hope you have understood this concept of interpolating in labview and i hope you have enjoyed this video thanks for watching this video